Okay, so Easter weekend and we're down at Port Solon and it's absolutely ramo, full of cars and people. So um, let's go and have a look around, see what we can see. That camper, look. Well, it's not even a camper, is it? It's a, oh, the seat looks comfortable, don't it? <laughs> Subaru boxer engine. It's got a Subaru engine here. Careful, she's a cougar. <laughs> nice Maserati convertible coming in. Police car. <laughs> Look at that. That's a sexy car. Beetle. <laughs> and a uh, Baja bug. And another beetle. And a beach buggy. That's very cool. How about the uh, Carmen gear? <laughs> I didn't see that. Longboards on top. I do love a Carmen gear. Very cool long boards on top of the. Very smart. See, I'm a loo. That's not something you see very often. Australian Ute. Yeah, they're like Australian type thing. What? It, yeah, exactly. So the four door version of this is what I said to be a sensible car. That came past as well as at McDonald's. Safi Cosworth. So look. Sensible car. That's insane. Oh, there you go. You want to see what I was talking about? Yeah, I've seen this car a lot. He's got a great number plate. <laughs> this is what I was talking about. This is a sensible car. They're not sensible. No, I know. <laughs> sensible when you're talking about Bugattis and. Yeah. <laughs> see? Miami, Miami Beach Police. I think it's actually a proper one. Nice plate. Yeah, yeah 62 cop. Yeah. Massachusetts police. in the back windows. Well, it needs a bit of work, but... They were little cars, though, weren't they? <laughs> Get a year shopping in the back of that one. Paul. Those VXR 220s are really rare, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> Every, every, everywhere we go. This is very nice. And I'm not a Beamer fan, but a three litre CSO. Very, very cool. Interiors are so basic, it's amazing, it's awesome. Wooden floorboards. Yeah. Seen the names on the yeah, side of the driver. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Wow. What he paid Stevie Wonder. <laughs> yeah, he's really good. I like that. Have you seen the interior? That's very cool. Wow. Stand Laurel and Laurel Hardy. <laughs> Cavalier? I wouldn't have got it in. 
I've been refused too many times, don't bother now. Yep. The original advert I saw didn't say that, not too cavy. Right? But then I saw it advertised later on and it was. A couple of BT or a BTCC Mondeo over here. Another MX5. A very old ropey pretzel. Good spoiler. <laughs> CR6. Oh, I could fancy the car speed. 05 series. That's what my old man had. Very nice lowered beamer. Mobile. Well, that's nice, guy. I think somebody had a leak when he got here. Yeah. Oh dear. Hell of a leak. Yeah. Not quite sure that he's going to enjoy the drive home. <laughs> Supra. I'm not bitter. <laughs> 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 I think this was here last time I came. Amazing yeah, machine. Chop the roof and then stick an engine in the way. Yeah? Chop the roof and then stick an engine in the way. I do like a livery. BTCC Mondeo. It's nice. Very nice car. Rides in it as well. There you go. Here's the killer. There's the killer. Backwards into a bush. It's not a bad way to finish your day. On fire. Oh, okay. Backwards into a bush. Nice RX7. Lovely RX7, lovely rims on it too. Uh, and it's 400. Look at the dish on the back of it. And it's 400. <laughs> they are. They're only 19s, they're not as wide either. Not as wide tyres. It's a 4 litre V8, and to be fair. R33 GTST. A lovely 300 ZX next to a Corvette. Is that Harry's, do you think? Yeah, we're well, starting. This is the start of the new sort of generation of JDM, isn't it? No, I don't think so. Next to a Quattro. I actually need you, though. Maybe someone's dashed, not such. So, nice R8 next to a Quattro. Gene Hunt. Yeah. Same car. Would you call me? <laughs> Can't believe how big these things are. They're ginormous. The interior is nice as well. That thing's insane. Have you noticed though? Not only is it a very big car, but they've also put wide arches on it. Yeah, to make it even bigger. Come and have a look at the exhaust. My little run around. <laughs> Crazy. Very nice. 
<laughs> I like the airbrushing. There's a load of that called Shrek and all of that sort of stuff, so we went with Lily Monster. Very, very cool. Oh, yeah. They've made it. I'll choose if I was going to go for a, yeah, a Lotus. Like pocket rockets, isn't it? This would scare you. Oh, Honda lump. A what? It's a Honda lump. Yeah, well, it is, isn't it? No, but it's not supposed to be. It's supposed to be a Toyota lump, isn't it? I'm sure these didn't these have the sneaker uh, engine then. This, this, this <laughs> It wasn't a Honda turbo lump, I tell you that, that's not an original lump. That's a supercharger, isn't it? Could be. Yeah, yeah it is. Yeah. This is the yeah, go well. Rev better, isn't it? Yeah. Aston Martin? Two. Oh, no. Maserati. No, it's a pair of Aston Martin. Oh, yeah, I didn't even spot the other one. <laughs> Do like a uh, Maserati. Yeah, unfortunately, Maserati is like the Gary. Yeah. I sent you a link to one, didn't I? There was one of these for sale for like yeah, six grand. Yeah, chips. Maybe that'll take spot number three. But, um... Yeah. Look at that. AC Cobra? That'd be a close one for the garage. <laughs> Mark III Cavalier as well. I was looking at this earlier, I haven't got a clue what it is apart from a Fiat. Alpine. MZ uh, 300 ZX we saw earlier. I'm not going to get one over. It is. And here's the R34. <laughs> Very nice R34. With a Z tune kit on it as well. Okay, so from a distance, we spotted this bloody great big spoiler. So we've got to go and have a look and see what it is. <laughs> And it, it's on an Audi TT, some hot rods leaving, and that is what you call a big spoiler. <laughs> Jesus. Wow, that's a big spoiler. That's WRX. Well, it stands out. It is actually higher than the roof line. <laughs> 